Ano ba yung na-apply mo sa bago? I'm applying internship as youth staff because right now I am 8 years professor in college school. This year, uh, I am also a professor in Lyceum Cavite. Okay. And I want to shift my career in cruise line because I think that is my real passion because I done my course as information technology. That's why I apply also a assistant IT officer in okay. cruise. But my life was in culinary. So I tried myself to done with something in culinary, cooking, and everything, but I am pursuing also my career as professor in LICU. Uh, I want to ask to the others, can I apply in different like staff or IT officers or assistant, IT officers, someday in your accountants. Okay, from uh, Magsay Sarun. Okay. Nakakatawa, no? Kasi I just also monitor your Facebook account. Yung mga ganun po ulit-ulit. Ganun no? nakakatawa yun. Sana screenshot ko na lang. Nakakapagod din mag-reply sa mga... And I'm so very proud to mga ad ad admin na walang sawa nagtatanong. Okay? So, siyempre, um, I cannot say anything else. Hindi kita ma-assess hanggang hindi ko nakikita yung hard copy ng resume mo, okay? Siguro, eh, this is a piece of advice lang. Um, you mentioned about the cruise staff, okay? So, well, the cruise staff that we are looking for, so we are not the one who's setting up the standards, try, try to understand that, okay? Because we have a specific principles, a principle, a specific requirements that we need to adhere and satisfy their requests. So, our job, as a money agency, we are evaluator and assess according to the needs of our principals. For the for the cruise staff requirements of other principals like PNO Australia, PNO Cruises, Resort World Cruises, these are known for star cruises. Because they say they are required to cruise staff. Um, for Resort World Cruises, what they are looking for that they are good in events, good in hosting, dancing. They can communicate well during the bingo night or something. Uh, the personality must be must be lively and etc. And so on. For PNO, uh, Australia, UK, we call this one as a youth coordinator. They in charge with the children on board, categorized into teen and children. So what would be the minimum requirements? Must be a licensed teacher. Secondary education much better, and uh, major elementary dealing with the children. Okay, so you are good in our, uh, you are good in storytelling. You are good in artworks because some of the fan, fan cruise, fan cruise is a family cruise like yung mga malalaking barko. Carnivals is a fan cruise, so yung mga bata sila kasama iniiwan sa mga child care, no? So the experience must be like that. Hindi tapat tatagal ng at least two years. Two years naman? Two years. So dapat, mas better presently working. Uh, yun ang qualification natin. Okay? So, pangalawa, ang mention mo, you are now work... Uh, I, ano po ako eh? Professor po sa Lyceum. Lyceum? Hindi ba tayo nagkikita ito? Kabite po sa... Ah, Kabite, from Manila. May klase kami ngayon, kaya lang may mas pinarayotipin namin ng buhay kong ship. Okay? Uh, Alright. So my answer, ano, you are teaching cruise line or ano? Uh, under po ako ng Coexa, uh, information, te uh, information technology. Okay, so ano na yun? Yes, so information te technology, tumatagaw naman tayo ng IT. Dapat, anong system ang hawak ng IT, ma'am? Uh, CSCO? Oo, oh, yung mga ganun. So the, the company must be in the IT company. Uh, ano ba yung kinukuha namin madalas? They are the BPO company, but in the technical side, that are out of the, ano, yung mga sumasagot. So, yun ang mga minimum requirements natin. Hindi naman kailangan license ka doon, but as long you have a very solid experience. Okay? Na mention ba that you are planning to become a cook? Yeah. Very good. Kung, honest na sa'yo tayo, we are challenging the cook, no? So, yun po yung kailangan natin i-develop. Ano po ang, Sobrang kailangan namin, nahirap-hirap kami mag-recruit ng mga kusinero. Yung mga higher position. Siyempre, yung mga entry level, okay lang yan ang po-promote naman sa mga barko. 
Right now, we are challenging to recruit the Panyaki chef. Yan. And Japanese chef, kasi we have a new vessel coming from under Mopas. Na yung Silver Sea ata, mapupunta sa Mopas. Ang, ang maganda lang kasi sa industry natin, umiikot lang tayo. Uh, kailangan may collaboration kami sa mga iba-ibang money agency. Yung cook, maganda. Okay? So, well, sa pagiging cook, we need at least six months experience to one year experience. But the good thing with that, because we have a special program for Mika, kasi may mga principal sila na tumatanggap without no experience as long as we finish the 600 hours of GP. Alam ko, ganun si Yano. And as I pray, we still encourage you to earn experience. Kasi, number one, you need to be more emotionally and physically ready on board. Iba pa rin nararamdaman ng amoy ng kusina, Iba pa rin pag nakikita mo yung mga kintap ng mga gamit sa kusina, iba pa rin na you are exposed on the real situation. But, if you, kung wala naman kayong pera, you can go to our technical school, TESTA, wala namang problema yon. Pero siyempre, iba pa rin kapag nakapocus kayo, siyempre, the training institution will provide a quality training. So you will pay for that, and you will pay for the services and the facilities. Ganun yun. So, nasa inyo yun kung ano yung gagawin nyo. But at the end of the day, you still need at least one new experience. But I, I guarantee you, ma'am, ano pong principal na sa tumak? PMO? Princess. Princess. Costa. Costa. Yan, tumatanggap sila ng mega graduate 600 hours OGT experience. Pero syempre, you need to, to wait pa rin. Kasi there is a process. But the preparation, at alam nyo may mapupuntan kayo. That's a good thing. But we still encourage our graduates from Mika na while they are processing their documents, they need to be more productive. Kasi nagiging problema kasi sa mga seaman, pag nag-clip na, wala na. Nakatampay na lang sila, tapos buburayin yung mga manager. Di ba? Wala na po kami yung dating date, ganyan-ganyan. Hindi po kami may hawak ng rotation. Tandaan nyo, may kalabang tayo dito. Mga ibang lae, di ba? Nakakailindihan ba tayo? Di ba? Very good. So the good thing, the best characteristic of being a good seafarer is being patient. But, siyempre, at the end of the day, it comes with a character. Diba? Character ang pinag-uusapan dito. So, siyempre, you need to understand the process. You need to be productive. Aba, nag-iintay kayo, magtrabaho kayo sa mga hotel. While waiting for your joining day. Tama ka na eh? Tama. Kasi pag wala kayong ginagawa, mas lalo kayong magsasuffer.